Eagle syndrome is a rare condition caused by an elongated or deviated styloid process and or calcification of the stylohyoid ligament, which interferes with adjacent anatomical structures giving rise to pain. Signs and symptoms Possible symptoms include, otalgia, dysphagia, foreign body sensation in throat, odonophagia, pain on chewing, pain when turning the head, intense pain when the stylohyoid process is palpated in the wall of the pharynx, pain along the distribution of the carotid artery, usually the condition is present on only one side, however rarely it may be present on both sides. Two forms of Eagle syndrome exists, the classic form and the vascular one. Patients with the classic Eagle syndrome can present with unilateral sore throat, dysphagia, tinnitus, unilateral facial and neck pain, and otalgia. In patients with the vascular form of Eagle syndrome, the elongated styloid process is in contact with the extracranial internal carotid artery. This can cause a compression or a dissection of the carotid artery causing a transient ischemic event or a stroke. Cause The cause of the condition is unknown. Diagnosis Diagnosis is suspected when a patient presents with the symptoms of the classic form of Eagle syndrome for example unilateral neck pain, sore throat or tinnitus. Sometimes the tip of the styloid process is palpable in the back of the throat. The diagnosis of the vascular type is more difficult and requires an expert opinion. One should have a high level of suspicion when neurological symptoms occur upon head rotation. Symptoms tend to be worsened on the manual palpation of the styloid through the tonsillar bed. They may be relieved by infiltration of lidocaine into the tonsillar bed. Because of the proximity of several large vascular structures in this area this procedure should not be considered to be risk-free. Imaging is important and is diagnostic. Visualizing the styloid process on a CT scan with 3D reconstruction is the suggested imaging technique. The enlarged styloid may be visible on an orthopantogram or a lateral soft tissue X-ray of the neck. It is worth noting that the styloid may be enlarged in 4% of the population and only a small minority of people with enlarged styloids have symptoms. Treatment In both the classic and vascular form, the treatment is surgical. A partial stylodectomy is the preferred approach. Repair of a damaged carotid artery is essential in order to prevent further neurological complications. Regrowth of the stylohyoid process and relapse are a common occurrence. Epidemiology Approximately 4% of the general population have an elongated styloid process, and of these about 4% give rise to the symptoms of Eagle syndrome. Therefore, the incidence of stylohyoid syndrome may be about 0.16%. Patients with this syndrome tend to be between 30 and 50 years of age but it has been recorded in teenagers and in patients greater than 75 years old. It is more common in women, with a male-female ratio 1-2. History The condition was first described by American notorhinolaryngologist Watwim Ziegel in 1937. References